kung I was asking you earlier, um, and of course you said no. If the, if we had a soji bill, would this change the situation for Pura Luca Vega? No, it won't. Actually, mm -hmm. uh, nakakatuwa ano nung nangyari yung uh, kay Pura Luca Vega, yung usapin kay Pura Luca Vega. Maraming uh, opponents ng Soji Equality Bill sinasabi, Naku, ayan, wala pang Soji Equality Bill, lumalakas na ang loob ng LGBTQ+. Kung ano nung ginagawa nila, sinasamantala nila at niyuyurakan ang karapatan ng mga straight na tao. Uh, well, surprise, surprise, ang Soji Equality Bill will not justify mm -hmm. similar acts. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, he, apparently, dito sa kaso ni Pura Leuca Vega, merong uh, violation, no? possible violation ng Article 203 of the Revised Penal Code. But, uh, of course, the Social Equality Bill does not repeal that law. It mm -hmm. does not uh, deal with that uh, issue. And this is a totally different matter. So, mm -hmm. then the question is, mm -hmm. is it time to revise the Penal Code? Um, because of course, those uh, there were those who are saying that this is a, we should respect the right to free expression. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes. Well, I believe now, kahit anong karapatan ay hindi naman absolute. Hindi sabihin nun only ang karapatan mo. Di ba meron tayong kasabihan, my rights end where your rights begin. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. uh, I think that we should all respect one another. And you should practice kindness. Alam mo, minsan, na uh, in the name of artistic freedom, mm -hmm. eh talaga namang uh, we feel emboldened to hurt other people's feelings. And then, when people react as human beings normally do, pag nasakta ng kanilang kalooban, we now play the victim or we say na, ay, nako, you are not respecting my artistic freedom. I am fully aware that artistic freedom always entails some sort of risk when it comes to mm -hmm. offending mm -hmm. other people. But uh, I think the uh, trick is not to repeal the existing law, but to find a balance. And of course, a basic guideline that all of us should practice, you know, mm -hmm. it's kindness and good manners and right conduct. Pag naka-offend ka ng kapwa-tao mo, ano ba naman ang mawawala sa'yo? Pero medyo nagulat ako sa totoo ka. lang na nakulong siya. Um, I mean, ang daming may kaso dyan oh. na hindi naman nakikita behind bars. Uh -huh. But for Pula Luca Vega, um, she was arrested. Naging mabilis sa kaso ni Pula Luca mm -hmm. Vega. I don't know why. Uh, dapat natin siguro tanungin yung huwes na nag-handle ng case sa Manila, no? Uh, merong grupo na nag-demanda kay Pura Luca Vega, yung Ihos del Nazareno, mm -hmm. sa Quiapo. And all they were there asking were for is... Yeah. Among yeah. others. Yeah. Among yeah. others. Yeah. Meron din yung uh, uh, Philippines for Jesus Movement, mm -hmm. which is an evangelical mm -hmm. group. Hindi yeah. lang pang-katoliko. So that must say something. Talaga siguro may nasaktan. Now, was Pura imprisoned or charged because drag artist siya? No. Drag is not a crime. But offending religious sensibilities mm -hmm. under our present laws is. How could she have done it better? I mean, kung may ganong uh, intention to send the message na we want acceptance, ito yung hinanakit namin for the longest time with the Catholic Church. I mean, how could she have done that And also, just better? to point out that she did apologize, mm -mm. right? But they didn't uh, accept the apology. People I don't were, think she, uh, you know. I don't think Pura apologized. Uh, well, in fact, uh, Pura was very young. Uh, uh, vehement no, in saying that, uh, no, I will not apologize because I did not I do anything wrong. And that okay. uh, uh, they will also, uh, I mean, uh, Pura will also mm -mm. do it again, mm -mm. you know. Mm -mm. I don't think that uh, constitutes a sincere apology. You know what, uh, if I have a chance to talk to Pura, this is what I'm going to tell them. Them mm -hmm. is how mm -hmm. Pura the wants Pura to be addressed. Ah, okay. It's they or them. Mm -mm. So, Pura, um, Walang mawawala sa'yo kung sabihin mo lang na sorry kung na-offend ko ang mga damdamin nyo. Hindi yan ang intention ko. Ang intention ko lang ay gusto kong express mm -hmm. yung aking hinanakit sa simbahang katolika. Mm -hmm. Maybe we can talk it out. And that won't make you less of a person. Mm -hmm.